friends back here with my 16th scale RC excavator from Double Eagle or Double E as it says right there on the arm of the excavator. Now I've done a few videos of this excavator in action and it actually does pretty good for being a toy slash hobby grade RC. Now I want to show you what I got here because I ordered one of the DIY attachment items uh, which I talked about that previously in the unboxing where you can change out the boom and put either a grabber which is the chloral or you can do the breaker slash hammer which is what I have here and my friends this is nice. Now this is made of metal actually let me grab a little screwdriver made of metal even a tip is made of metal now this thing looks pretty cool. This is the first time I'm trying it out, guys. I've not tried this thing out uh, since I got it. Now the way this plugs up to is actually there's a little little slot right there where the uh, connection plugs in, and it's just a little like a stereo jack thing. <laughs> so I'm gonna test this out and see how well this thing works. So, let me put the camera on the tripod and we'll get to it. So to put it on, all we gotta do is push up these little pins, got a little flat head, and just push it right out. It slides right out the other side here. Pull it out like so. There we go. Keep that to the side. Do the other side the same way. There we go. Boom, the bucket comes off. I love that metal bucket. Really nice. Alright, so we'll set that to the side and we'll grab our breaker slash hammer. This is nice. Metal. It's got some oil in there too. There's our little jack for it. Let's get the uh, little zip tie off of it. A little tie wrap. I am tightening it up. Aha, there we go. Huh. It's coming. <laughs> Alright, so back together like so. There, grab our little connections here. Put them in place. Aha! Ah, got it. All right, the next one. Boom. Now put it into the little phone jack up there. And boom. All right. Now let's go ahead and test this thing out.
let's see if I hold it. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Alright, let's see. The, let's get this. So I hold it, and it definitely seemed to do a lot better. Let's see. Look at it right there. Let's get a little brush in here and brush that away. Actually, let's just do this. <laughs> Let's see if it left a hole in it. Ah, we got a little hole right there. So, let's take it back down. Alright, so I got lifted up. And let's go for it. Get it. Raise it up more than it off the ground. Uh. Up, it's all the way up. Uh, sorry, get blurred on you. <laughs> Look at that guys, up in the air. Alright, raise it up. Let's see, let's see. Definitely. Put a nice little groove in there. Now, this is really thick clay, guys. This is something I was working at a job site, but look at all the powder. They grinded up some stuff. Look at that. Boom. So I have to say, not too shabby. I mean, again, this is a toy grade, uh, toy slash hobby grade RC, but it is metal, metal tip, which, I mean, look, guys, it actually broke up some clay. Uh, not bad for you know this very tough clay. We actually had to use an actual jackhammer to bust up all that uh, clay to uh, dig out the holes and stuff like that. So I grabbed some of this stuff and uh, definitely thick, but it was doing a good job. I'm actually kind of impressed with it. I don't know how you guys think, but uh, I think I really like it. Definitely works out a lot better. The sound definitely... <laughs> definitely sounds a lot better without the sound on because I mean it does a constant uh, when the arm goes down and scoot sound so it looks like so yeah definitely works a lot better with the sound off I'm sorry uh, that if the video uh, I know it plays some of it with sound and I started doing some without the sound so I'm sorry guys if you got annoyed with that sound I tried to turn the volume down a little bit on that but yeah so that's the uh, breaker slash hammer from double E and uh, like I said this is on the 16th scale uh, excavator from them 17 channel 2.4 gigahertz controller uh, definitely works nice I'm very impressed with it Alright guys, so well, thanks for watching and thank you for putting up with the sound of this machine and uh, next time I'll know not to do it with the sound on. So guys, thanks for watching and I will see y'all.
Later.